today on another exciting edition of What's Morgan Drinking. Whew. Here it is, ladies and gentlemen. Ghost Warheads Sour Watermelon. Now, I've been excited to drink this drink and many of the other ones that are like it. I haven't been able to find Ghost in Town until I finally found one at my local Albertsons. So anyone that has an Albertsons chain in their town, go seek this out, because apparently this is like the greatest ever energy drink of all time. Ah. And, I mean, I'm dubious. I'm 300 in? I don't know how many. Even just on my YouTube channel, I'm like 150 there. And I have another 200 on my personal Facebook page. So, why am I dubious? Well, it's an energy drink. Like, what am I to test? What am I to know? of this. Well, decades of science now at this point. <laughs> and no reassuring things on the back, to be honest. I like the can design, I'll give you that. It has some really interesting little writing and sayings on it, so that's cool and clever. Legendary Energy Epic Focus Zero Sugars No Artificial Flavors 1,000 milligrams of Carnipure... Carnipure?! What is Carnipure? <laughs> milligrams of alpha GPC 50%, 100 milligrams of neurofactor, and 100% of four daily vitamins. This is all of it. This is it. Gluten-free, vegan-friendly, soy-free, and sugar-free. This is it. This is peak energy drink. It's got nothing inside of it, but it's supposed to taste incredible. That is the promise of energy drinks, isn't it? Give you energy, taste great, have nothing that'll harm you inside of it. One of these things is not like the other... Let's find out which one in this can for science. I genuinely have no idea what to think. I am. It's genuinely a canyon, uh, canyon company, candy company advertising now. Do we want green? Do we want red? Let's see. We get clear. Of course we get clear. We all know better at this point. Sometimes you'll get a color. Sometimes. But it's not often. And it's always an off... I don't know how they made this color. And I don't know if you can see it. It's off clear. I don't know if you can see this by way of comparison. I got a water glass here. You see that? The difference in color? Awful. Okay, it's, it smells like a sour watermelon. Mm. I can feel it like this part of my eyeballs here behind not up here in the front in the back of my eyeballs and just like in a camera it focuses the light even more that way it hits exactly where it needs to be on the retina Morgan what does it taste like? Oh. I think this can's gimmick is sour. Because it's definitely sour. They knew how to turn up and get at least a portion of that warhead sensation. Of the truly sour pungency in the back of your tongue and the back of your eyeballs. Mixed with some very harsh carbonation. Those two in conjunction definitely give the sensation of forehead. But as always, that is the distraction from the horrific things you're putting inside of you. The chemicals, the artificial sugar, and that sour is just disguising a bitterness that is unmatched from fake sugar and so many vitamins. It, it is exactly this. If you have a, a single, one single sour watermelon warhead in your mouth, but then you, you take multivitamins, antibiotics, cough syrup, and like aspirin, and you have to take like one pill at a time, and the only thing to coat your mouth, you don't get water, you get seltzer water, this single warhead, and then each of those pills, one at a time, down into your body. 
and each time you can taste those as well, but the, the sour watermelon and the really sharp carbonated water mask it enough that you forget you're taking your medicine. Thanks for watching. One children's vitamin comes complete with the great Flintstones taste and fun character shapes kids love. We are